Hey folks, welcome back to another NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs. This is another Western Conference game in game number five. As the Oilers take on against the LA Kings back at LA for the Crypto.com Arena. So far, the Oilers have already have won three games in a row. And now they're looking for a chance to win the fifth game. If not, then the LA Kings wins, and then they will head to enforcement into game six after a 3-2 count. Well, we're not sure who will win the next one for this game, but you will find out once the game is over. It, or the uh, scoring in between each period. So, without further ado, we don't know what will happen. Now it's time to send you down to, uh, to uh, the, all the commentary crew. As we have, uh, as we have some uh, another amazing matchups here between the Canada and the USA team of the Rivals. Now let's take you over to James Zdolski and Greg Ferraro for the game five, guys. Stick around later for the next game that we will have right now for the next Eastern Conference matchups. At least we'll have the Hurricanes and the Bruins back at the PNC Arena. And of course, we have along with the Bolts and the Maple Leafs that will be happening here for the next one. And then, Wilds and Predators that will be happening here at Minnesota at the XL Center Energy Arena. So, it's time to get things on. Oh, Guys? Still no score yet. We're looking for a goal here for game five. Five fields won the draw. The Oilers have it now. 
Fomos carrying it ahead. And it takes a shot. Nothing. Picked up along the wall by Bouchard. Made the stop on that play. And now it's over to Brown. Down the right side and into the zone. Wrist one. And he comes up big with the stick save. Getting all of it with the paddle. Here's a shot. And that's blocked. Los Angeles looks to break out in their own end. Dishes it to Brown. Moves inside! I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, I won't complain. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. We've still got zeros on the board. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck. Now a quick pass to Bouchard. Dished on over to Hyman. Rips it on net. Denies him. He got all of it. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. Both teams ready here for the faceoff. LA has won the faceoff deep in their own end. And a stick in the lane to flex that one away. Here he is in front. Oh, what a stick save. Long jam in front. That's broken up. And that one's blocked. Dismiss that chance. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Los Angeles wins the draw. Scrum ensues along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Deneau. Picking up momentum inside the neutral zone. From behind the net. A chance in front. Fantastic stick save by Smith. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Mato's got it in the defensive end. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Deneau. Handles a puck at the point. And now it's grabbed by Puglia-Yarby. Stoppage in play as the puck goes up and over. We'll get a face-off. Dreisaitl's tape-to-tape zone ability means he can complete those firm, crisp passes that help keep the play moving. He's so effective at distributing the puck and setting up his teammates. Kopitar's won a big draw on their own end. Los Angeles moves ahead with the puck. Steps inside the line. Puts it to the front of the net. Oh, if there's going to be a regret in this one, that might be it. Yeah, that play is right there to be had. They just miss the pass. The scoring chance goes away. Let's it go. Comes up with a stop. He was telling me this morning he worked on this in practice this week, making sure the puck goes to the corner and doesn't stay in the net. LA has got it along the wall. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. Trying just a little bit too much there, foiled on that play. LA's got the puck now. Nice zone entry from the right side. Cuts into the paint. That goes on its way. Puck picked up by Kipping. Taken by Dreisaitl. Edmonton's across the blue line. Here he is in close. Quick's gonna hang on to the puck for a whistle. Past the midway mark of the frame. Still no score in this one. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Feeds it to Brown. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Los Angeles has possession of the puck. Grabbed along the board by Nurse. Slides it across to Pugliarvi. Moves it to Hyman. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. LA's got it in the defensive zone. Slides it on over to Brown. Into the offensive zone. The Kings have it from the corner. Denies him! And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a 
stoppage in play. Looking for some defense out there for the Oilers. If they wanted to get the puck, they got to go for it. Edmonton's got possession here in their own end. McDavid's got it for the neutral zone. The Kings get a hold of the puck in their own end. Here they come. Puts it on that, and he comes up with it. Uses the boards with the bank pass. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Here's a short pass to Pugliarmi. And that shot dies in traffic. Gains the zone through center. Carey's taking it from his own end. The Oilers move to the offensive zone. Here he is from the slot. Off a stick. LA's gained possession along the boards. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. The Kings take it along the wall. Edmonton's got possession of the puck. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Cuts to the paint. Stopped by the goaltender. Back to the blue line. Quick feed to Dreisaitl. Sends a pass over. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. Nice pass. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Puts it on goal. And a great save. LA is looking to break out. The Oilers have it behind the net. And that's picked off. Quick pass to Anderson. Moves the puck across to Kopitar. Nice zone entry from the left. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. And it's a quick pass to Kempe. And now he moves it quickly to Ayafalo. Puck grabbed by Barry. Sends the pass over. Dumps it in. Los Angeles looks to get things going now with the puck. A chance! Oh. Scores! Ryan Nugent Hopkins! Edmonton saw the board first, Lady 1-0. This was hard work to get on the board here. Neither team giving up a lot. But now we got one. Maybe it'll open up. Edmonton goal. His first goal of a season. Justin Hergen Hopkins. Time of the goal, 18-26 remaining in first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Here inside the defensive zone. Shot, and that carries off a stick. Turn that chance aside. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Here in the lane going to the frame. one nothing is where we sit at this point. Edmonton's got it, and they're on the attack. Stops the rocket of a shot. Quick's going to smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. Face off, looming as both centers get into position. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Oilers gain possession. LA's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Feeds it over to Bata. Handles the pass at center. That's blocked. The Oilers play along the boards. There's another for the hit parade. Los Angeles takes hold of the puck. Passes the puck over to Moore. Great hit on the play. Edmonton's got the puck in their own end. LA's got possession here in the neutral zone. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Gets the full use of his stick on the boat check. Ryan's got the puck in his own zone. Into the attacking area from the left side. You'll need more than that to beat him. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Almost done for the first period. It's 1-0 Edmonton. 
Last minute remaining in first period. Second period coming up. One nothing is the Oilers. On now to the second inter uh, period. Both teams with a chance to recharge and refresh, and this second period about set to get underway. And we're not sure who's going to win this second one, so we'll be we'll be right with you after this game. going on for the Kings. This could be the end. Kempe's been in some discomfort since he took this hit. A clean hit right through the box. Yeah, Adrian Kemp is done. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. We got a one nothing game at this point. And now it's grabbed by Anderson. Here's a short pass to Kopitar. Oh, it's somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps it up in. Quick feed to Hyman. Edmonton's moving the puck through center ice. Gets it to the other point. Stones him in front. As soon as he can turn himself towards the net, he is gone. They don't catch him, but the goalie makes the save on a nice effort. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Let's it go. Pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. 
Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. That's not going to fool him. Quicks on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up and kills the play. Looks like they're 2-1. Looks like there might be a battle of the battle going on without the Lakers or Clippers. The Kings take possession off the faceoff. And now he moves it to Brown. Great pressure to force the turnover. Receives the pass. And that goes wide. He misses by a large margin right in the middle of the ice. Edmonton's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Made the save on the play. And smashed the puck out of midair. Puts it in deep. The Oilers gain control of the puck. Takes the pass. And he slides it quickly to McDavid. Oh, what a blocker stop by Quick. Moves into the slot. Gives him nothing in front. He's going to go back to the bench and want to look at that one again. He had enough time to really make a good shot. I don't think he quite got it where he wanted to. Great hook check on the reach. And now he passes it to Pugliarvi. Gains the zone. Keeps hold of the puck. Makes the save. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Brown. Los Angeles has the puck. And the intensity starting to ramp up here after that hit. Puck picked up by Athanasiu. The Kings played along the boards. The Oilers have it against the wall. Sends it over to Dreisaitl. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Here he is, wristed on net. Oh, and he just puts it wide in the net. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. Los Angeles is across the blue line. Here he is, shot right in front. Smith's going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. LA's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. Play results as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Barry's got it along the board. Los Angeles steps inside. Here's a shot. Left save made by Smith. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Teams are ready for the draw. The line's been about to drop the puck. There's a lot of passing going on. It's been, it's in the slim a bit. The frozen biscuits dropped and we are back underway here. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Takes a shot. Scores and quite the counter punch. We're on the duck. Now that you've scored this time goal, you'd like to follow it up with a shift or two. See if you can really change the momentum. Edmonton goal is first goal of the playoffs. Scored by number 29 as Kane. His first assist by number 22, Darnell Nurse. And by number 23, Leon Dreisaitl. Time of the goal, both 6.45 remaining in the first second period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. won the draw. The Oilers have it now. Pugliarvi's got it on the offensive end. Takes the shot. Oh, what a stop! And he regains control of the puck. Shot! Big time stop there. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. There is still even up. The neck-to-neck -neck run is the biggest tough one in the night. Edmonton's won the draw. Oh, what a stop with the paddle! Quick 
that's going to slow things down and up for the whistle. Well, you got to kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. Some last-second communication with the D as centers get ready to drop the puck. Lazat's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Gets the puck over to Mata. Takes the feed. Jumps it into the Ozone. The Oilers have it now. Looking for space inside the D zone. Gaining momentum along the wing. Slides the puck over. Edmonton saw the attack. And just a good old fashioned solid body check on the play. Plus saved by goalie. Quick's locked in. Every puck hits him and stays in front of him. At the odd chance there's a rebound, he tracks that well too. Quick feed to Pugliarvi. Slides the puck over to McDavid. And that was stopped. Really good save. Control the rebound. Get it into the corner where you can reestablish yourself. Wrist wide front. Oh, gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. Drives to the sweet spot. The blocker saved by Smith. Big time shot block there. Puck grab by Barry. The Oilers move it in. Oh, and just like that, steals the puck and goes the other way. Quick pass to Kopitar. Boots the puck. And that one's turned away. The Oilers gain control of the puck against the wall. Quick pass to Yamamoto. Moves the puck along the half wall. And now he tries to get it across to Kane. Denied that one. The Kings get a hold of the puck along the boards. Los Angeles has it in the defensive end. The Kings are in transition. And now he angles it across to Ayafalo. Shot with the stop. Smith's on top of that one for a whistle. A little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. We got a tie game. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside wow. the offensive zone. Puck scooped up by Yamamoto. They go on the attack from the left side. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Los Angeles with possession in their own zone. Takes a shot with the stop. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. The Kings take possession in the defensive end. Los Angeles has possession of the puck. And he slides it quickly to Anderson. To the low slot! Oh, what a save in front! Smith surprised a lot of people over his career with some of the saves he makes. Now, this isn't the best one ever. And man, this is a beauty. It surprised me. I didn't think he was going to get it. Turn that one aside. Edmonton's got the puck along the boards. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. LA is looking to break out of their own end. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Long reach breaks up the momentum. And he serves it across to McDavid. Edmonton's ready to go on the attack. Handles the puck. Stays with it. Shuts it down with the paddle. What a stop. Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. Here are the later stages of this period. It's all tied up. Deneau's won it in their own end. Loose puck battle along the boards. Taken along the wall by Deneau. Now a quick pass to Moore. The Kings take it across the line. Los Angeles on the attack. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Clay will get it. Let's get the call. Edmonton penalty, Darnell Nurse, two minutes for interference. And if they can, they can all go get a breather at the intermission. It is Kings, power play! Sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Well, the power play gets to dust itself off here. First opportunity tonight. The Kings win the... Two minutes for Edmonton. Interview number 25, Darnell Nurse for the interference. Nugent Hopkins. 
Titans. 1.25 remaining in a second. Ten two minutes for power play. Last minute remaining in second period. Will said, it can be three and two, but <laughs> we don't know. Third period's coming up. Still plenty of time left here for the breakout. Time for the opening face-off here in period number three. James Solowski and Ray Ferraro set to call the action. Well, we only have a few more, only a few more minutes, seconds here for the team's power play. End the power play. Nurse's penalty has expired. Dead eyes him on the play. Obviously a pretty important time in the game. The PK does a good job. Keeps this game tied. Here's a chance. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Edmonton's moving it into the offensive end. Let's the wrister go. Stop by the goaltender. This is a quality chance if the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. James Zabowski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Los Angeles wins the draw. The Kings move the puck in the defensive zone. The Oilers scoop it up along the boards. Gains the zone through the middle. Skins a hold of the puck against the boards. And some good footwork to kick it away. Big time stop. And now it's grabbed by Pugliari. Here's a chance right in the slot. Denied by the puck stopper. Quick's going to cover it up. He's been busy tonight, Ray. And been good. A lot of times you get busy and worn down. I think that's why you jump on it, freeze it in a close game. The centermen glide into position. LA's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Takes the feed, and it's a quick pass to Ayafalo. And he makes the easy save. And we got a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Still plenty of time left. Score still even. The Oilers get a hold of the puck in their own end. And now it's over to Dreisaitl. Into the offensive zone. Wrist shot from the slot. Oh, and he somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out of the net. But he came up and challenged a good save. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Puts it on net. Uh-uh, that's blocked away. Climbs to the crease. Takes a slap shot from the point. Denies him in front. Smothered that in close camp. Into the attacking end. And he's able to handle that one. And now he moves it to Pyfield. Dowdy's picking up momentum through center. Can't connect. Moves it quickly over to Kane. And that's intercepted by Pyfield. Here's a shot. Cuts it in for the go ahead goal. Control the game now. You finally got the lead. You worked so hard to get in front. Don't give it up now. The Kings are up by one. You don't like the term protect the league. Oh, I, I hate it, James, because that means you're just inviting the other. Kings off. goal! So His the first other goal of the playoffs, scored by number four, MJ Anastokos. 
Assisted by number four, Quintus Byfield. Time of the goal, 6.40 seconds in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Edmonton goal, the second goal in the playoffs. Scored by number 18, Zach Hyman. His first assist here by number two, Drew Tolkien. And by number two, And by number two, Drew Tolkien. Time of the goal. 12.43 remaining. 12.45 remaining in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Number 10, it's Corn Kevin. Time to go, 7.22 remaining in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. The Oilers have it behind the net. We got a back to back. Oh boy, not good to go. Back to even things up in the third. There were times it looked like they weren't going to get back to this point, but now you've made it a Edmonton goal, his second goal in the playoff, score by number 93, Ryan Duncan Hopkins. And by number 75, assisted by number 75, uh, Bocher. Time of the goal, 9.43 remaining in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. There's so much back-to-back -back switch. The next goal could be it. New but there's more time the left. And misses over the net. Now, tough to generate a rebound even when the puck misses the net by that much. And now it's grabbed by Moore. Los Angeles has it against the half wall. Kings goal! His first goal in the playoffs, scored by number 24, Brandon Oates. His first assist by number 20, Trevor Moore. And by number 33, Nick Colbar. Time of the goal. Goal, 8.32 remaining in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Puck scooped up by Keith. They fight for it along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Hyman. And now he moves it quickly to McDavid. Here's a chance. Oh, serves up waffles for dinner with that stop. Roy's lugging the puck. Moves it to Arvidsson. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Deneau. Here's 
second goal in a playoff score by number 24, Ben Reynolds. And assisted by number 23, Vince Sarfield. Time of the goal, 11 14, 14 remaining in a third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. We see just about every type of goal so far tonight, and we're not finished yet, James. This has no look of a game that's going to get locked down anytime soon. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. No corner given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Edmonton's working the transition through the middle of the ice. Shot! That's blocked by Quick. That's an important stop for the goalie. Not only does he make the save, but because he catches it, he kills the play. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession is so key in today's game. Los Angeles takes possession off the draw. Steps inside the line. And still using a stick to poke the puck away. Edmonton's got it along the wall. Puts it on net. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Fouling for it along the boards. The Oilers gain possession. Moves it to dry saddle. He scores! Well, don't turn this one off yet. Well, you better not. We're still here. We're here. You guys be here, too. Back in center ice, probably breathing a little easier now, right? They needed to get one, James. If you trail by two for too long, the clock just runs out on you. You run out of time. Edmonton goal. His first goal in the playoffs. Scored by number 29. Leon yeah, Dreisaitl. Leon Dreisaitl. The the and he assisted by number 13, Benjamin Yamamoto. Time of the goal, 12-25 remaining in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Offensive zone 
face off. Troy Seidel's won the face off. And now he tries to get it across to Kane. You can find out about the Kings. They are coming back. Seven to five is your final. Eight to five is your final score. And now it's time for your three star players of the game. Starting off with number three. Number three is as Drew Doughty. One goal, one assist, and four hits. Not just he did, but he just all oh, he had a doubt and no mind in question. He had it all. Number two is Andre Kopitar. Two goals, one assist, and one hit. Outstanding performance run, and also the empty netter to end the game in Game 5. And for number one, that one will go to Philip Donald with two, uh, two goals and one assist. He is never on here before. 
He is here for the first time since the Stanley Cup playoffs after the regular season is over. But in no melanie adoption, it ought to be all true to our fans who love the Kings. And that will do the game. 3-2 to two is the series of the Western Conference of the Oilers and Kings. The next matchup is coming down to the next one beginning tomorrow night as you all have the Bruins and Hurricanes back at the PNC Arena following along with another game of the Predators and Wilds at the XL's Energy Arena. There is much more coming your way here, but right now it is time to go. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next time for the next game of NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs and, of course, the ultimate one of the NBA Playoffs as well. So, we're still waiting for the Calgary Flames to play against the winning team of Edmonton or LA. So, there aren't any choices, but we'll have to find out if there's a chance here. And they will be back in Game 6, back at Edmonton, to do it again. Thank you for watching. Until next time, peace out everyone. For as while as the NHL 22, the Stanley Cup playoff dial. Thank you. Get home safely.